like there is no attack plan. Is that your robot impersonation? Thanks to Drake. Yep. But I hope I can bear the blood of the dragons raging through this body of mine. So, did you find out anything? Apparently, all the assassins get their instructions from the guild leader. My fairy friend told me the same thing. It said a certain boss is in charge of the whole guild. There's no question that the organization is pretty powerful. Did you happen to run into Master Ricardo? Master? Oh yeah, he asked me to breathe in the same air as him or something. Oh man, so cool! In what world is that cool? Well, everyone has their own take on things, I guess. I did learn one other interesting thing. There's a fruit out there that can give any living creature the ability to talk. Yes! Let's talk about that some more! Okay! No interest at all? Don't you care about anything but your precious Ricardo? It's called a babbleberry. Maybe if Drake ate one, even he could talk. Yeah! Now you're getting it! Oh, now that might be really fun! But this is no time to go running off looking for something like that. Uh. You're right. I have to keep searching for the Assassin's Guild. Uh, this sucks.
Jeez, I'm glad you're okay. It's because I had Drake with me. Indeed, I am a man among dragons. And this power emanating from within, it scares even me. One of the assassins told me they didn't have any plans to attack the royal wedding. And you think you can trust what they said? She has a point. What about Master Ricardo? Did he show up? As a matter of fact, he did. Really? What did he say? He was going on about wanting a big family or something. I'm not sure. Sounds obnoxious. Yeah, he shouldn't be so forward. He's such a sweetie. What? what? I'd love a big family. She's got the mad eyes of a woman in love. I think it's best if we just ignore her. Did you find out anything new? They told me to stop snooping around and that I shouldn't make their boss angry. So they threatened you, huh? They sound pretty dangerous. Did you happen to see Master Ricardo? Oh yeah, he said he wanted to marry me and then take me out on a date. He said all that to you? Oh, no fair! It's not even in the right order. Off in her own world. So, you visited all the islands you can reach right now. Yep. And none of the assassins admitted to knowing anything about an attack on the wedding. But we don't know if that's actually true. Isn't there any other way for us to find out more? One of them did mention that there's a guild headquarters out there somewhere. If I could find that, maybe I could get more info. But I have no idea where it is. Oh, Master Ricardo might know! He is a member of their fan club, right? Oh yeah, that's true, huh? I don't like where this conversation is headed. I know where Master Ricardo hangs out! Someone in the back alley was kind enough to tell me. Damn it! Why are we talking about Ricardo again? Okay. Toki, why don't you go talk to him? Yeah, good idea. <sighs> Do we seriously have to go deal with that guy again? So, Enda. Where's Ricardo? Oh, never mind. I don't remember anymore. Huh? Well, okay, I do. But I just don't want you and Master Ricardo to get any closer. Wow, you really like him that much? <laughs> okay. Toki, why don't you promise her something? Just to make her feel better. Huh? Promise that next time he makes a pass at you, you'll just turn him down immediately. Yeah, you're right. She should just come right out and be like, No way, Jose! These girls are really on to something. I thought I already did that, but okay. I promise I'll be more firm with him next time. Yay! Alright then. Great. Drake and I are gonna head out then. I'll meet up with you there later.